Uh, thanks for watching TopicsDesign.tv. I'm here with In the Shadow, and we've got some awesome music playing. And, and I'm here with Andy Hodge right now. He's the drummer for In the Shadow, and, and just want to kind of hear from him for a moment. Andy, uh, tell us about how you got started as a drummer for In the Shadow, or just as a drummer in general. How I got started as a drummer in general, uh, I guess I was about 14 or 15 years old. My brother showed me the most basic four beat on a drum set and I just worked on it, kept playing it, kept doing different stuff and uh, learned it and then asked for my own drum set, got my own drum set and that was pretty much the end of it at that point. Okay. I learned a lot from having my own drum set and I recommend that to anybody. If you're aspiring to be a drummer, then I highly recommend that you uh, you get your own drum set because it will help you out a lot. Yeah, definitely um, like as soon as possible, right? Right. And then yeah. uh, led you know that led to other opportunities i got the chance to play for the praise and worship team at my church uh taught me a little bit about the responsibility of being there and being dependent being dependable and uh then was like hey let's start a band it'd be fun and when did you start in the shadow because you're one of the original band members so right. how long ago was that uh that was in 2005 uh wanted to just start something, do something cool. We came back from a youth convention and uh, me and a buddy of mine just had a had an idea, let's start a band. And we had already had the name from, uh, this is getting into the jumping ahead maybe a little bit, but uh, right, how we got the name was we had a praise team. We were starting at our church, a youth praise team. And we had the name in the shadow from Psalms 91 verse one. Uh, he who dwells in the shelter of the most high will abide in the shadow of the almighty. And that's where we got it from. And that band, the praise team band, kind of disbanded. So we were like, well, let's take that name and carry it on and make it into a, our own thing. That's awesome. So um, when did you actually start the the rock band in the shadow? How long ago was uh, that? That was, we decided to do it, start it in November of 2005. 2005. We wrote okay, our first song, which was the first one we did tonight, yeah. uh, Do It All Again. We've been carrying that one since the beginning. Yeah, that's one of my favorites from the band. That's well, a good one. Well, yeah. I, I tell everybody, if we can't play that one right, then yeah. we might as well just hang it up now. <laughs> now, there's something interesting about you, Andy, and, and I, I don't know how true it is, but I've, I've heard that you always wear a superhero shirt during your shows. Is this true? I see maybe you're wearing not, one now. Maybe not during every show. Hey, he's not a superhero. He's a super well, villain. Yeah, well, you know what I mean. But, uh, <laughs> yeah, I'm a big, not a huge superhero buff. Some may call me a nerd, but um, I do enjoy I have a lot of superhero shirts in my repertoire and uh, in my drawer. So, <laughs> but people, I can see how people would say that. But I do have other shirts. I got, I love New York. I love <laughs> Los Angeles, different things like that. So, could you just name like every shirt that you have right now? No. No, that's all right. Okay. Uh, yeah, we've got some great music coming up from In the Shadows. So, keep watching. Our next song will be, do we know? Delete history, so tune in. We'll have that in just a moment. Thank you very much. We're back. There we go. Okay. We weren't on the screen, but we're good now. Uh, like I said earlier, this next song is called Delete History. It's, um, I'm not sure which camera to look at, but anyway, this is a good song.
87. We call it that because it's not really about Highway 87, but the tempo of it was 87 beats per minute. So we're like, hey, hey, we'll call it that because that highway is near here. Come here, come here. Bra. Yeah. Okay.
Sound of, uh, applause sound effects for us. Yeah. <laughs> okay, this next song is called Dale. That was uh, you want to explain that one, Zeke? No, I don't. I don't really know the story behind it. There was a old, there was a band in the area used to be called Dale. So we're like, hey, let's name this song Dale because they were cool. So here we go. <laughs> back with an interview with Zeke Leonard. So hold on tight. We'll be right back. <laughs> 